I've been talking about gait mim mimicry. These people that I've been seeing that are mimicking gait of other people, uh, one, one time I'll see them and they're mimicking gait, and then the next time I, I'll see them and they're not mimicking gait. So something is happening to them that causes them to have that gait for a little while. And I thought and thought about it. And uh, what I thought is that it reminded me of a time when I was, I had a meet up. Uh, the group met and there was a guy there who was supposed to read uh, some poetry, a poetry selection, like we took turns, you know. And when he started, to, when he looked at it and started to read it, something settled down onto him, onto his head and shoulders, and he read in a completely different voice from his usual voice, a voice that I recognized as that of someone else. And I wonder if this is similar to the gate mimicry ph phenomenon. In other words, a transference of of a feature of a person uh, to another person somehow. Even I wonder if it's the same being that's, that's doing this uh, in the case of the voice and in the case of the gate. And maybe in the case of other things, it's hard to say. I'm going to keep my eyes open about it.